Microsoft Surface Pro 9 is its most polished yet, with unmatched performance, output feature, and long battery life among high-end twin-one detachable Windows tablets. Microsoft's latest Windows 11 tablet gets faster and easier to fix in the Surface Pro 9, while offering more options than ever before. But is it still the best PC tablet going? The latest Surface Pro 9 machines are 12 gram lighter to last year's models but otherwise look almost identical to their predecessors. They are modern, well-made and come in a range of nice colors, with Microsoft's excellent kickstand out the back for propping the tablet up at the wide range of angles. The good 13-inch display is slightly brighter than last year and can dynamically switch between a 60Hz or 120Hz refresh rate for smooth scrolling by balancing battery life. The keyboard and Slim Pen 2 stylus are the same as last year, with little to fault, except that they are not included in the box and cost an additional 250 euro as a bundle. Inside the tablet has been made more repairable. It has an easier to replace battery and user upgradable storage in a little flap in the back, and the service manual and spare parts are being made available. It's not quiet the user repairable ideal demonstrated by the frame work laptop, but it is the biggest step in the right direction from Microsoft. The one negative is the removal of the headphone socket, leaving a USB-C dangle not included or Bluetooth as the only options. Using a range of Bluetooth headphones released in the past two years, with the Surface generally work well, so call audio quality is worse than if using a wire headset. The Wi-Fi only Surface Pro 9 comes with a choice of Intel Core i5 12 35U or i7 12 55U processors, which have roughly the same power efficiency but are up to 35% faster than the previous generation. That keeps the Surface Pro 9 in line with PC competitors for speed. The top Core i7 version feels slightly snappier, resuming from standby and other day-to-day -day operations than its direct predecessors. Battery life remains at about 8 hours of constant work, which should last the working day but not much more. It's not great compared with some laptops that can manage 16 hours between charges but is roughly in line with similar PC tablets. The story is very different from the version with the Microsoft SQ3 ARM chip. Its raw computing power is similar to the Intel version, so when using apps that are built for ARM chips such as Microsoft's various programs including Office and the Edge browser, it works great. The Surface Pro 9 runs Windows 11 and supports Windows Hello Face recognition for logging into the tablet or authenticating within apps and recently added support for running Android apps. Microsoft's best Windows 11 tablets gets what looks like a minor but needed speed increase in the Surface Pro 9 adding 12th generation Intel chipset. It's a bit snappier. The battery lasts about the same workday as previous versions. It has good 120Hz display and it is still one of the most compact and adaptable PC tablets you can buy. The removal of a headphone jack is a bit annoying as is Microsoft has still not included the essential keyboard in the box, but hidden away is a bigger upgrade, easier repair. The SSD can be upgraded from a small door at the back of the tablet while Microsoft has changed the insides to make the battery easier to replace, made a full service manual available and is making spare parts accessible to repairs. It isn't quite a revolution for repair the way the framework laptop may be, but it is still a big step in the right direction for Microsoft. The Surface Pro 9 with Intel chipset is therefore one of the very best Windows 11 tablets you can buy. For pros, good 120Hz screen, good Intel performance, Thunderbolt and USB port, excellent keyboard, essential additional purchase, excellent kickstand, Windows Hello, solid build, great stylus, removable SSD and easier to repair. And for cons, Expensive, keyboard should be included, no USB-A port, no micro SD card slot, no headphone jack, and the average battery life. Thank you so much for watching this video and I hope this video was useful for you. If you have any questions, please let me know subscribe to our channel so I can find a house of clear features and useful tools. See you soon in the next video.